How have you established mentors in your career and how have they helped most? I've become a more aggressive person as far as, you know, approaching people that I admire. I used to be afraid to. I used to be so intimidated by people. Um, but then I slowly found that the more successful a person is, the more willing they seem to be to help you and, and to get back to you. And I think, I don't know if, you know, if someone helped them along the way and they remember that or they're, or they understand that, you know, it's part of their role to, to, to mentor someone. So I have a few people that I consider to be my mentors. The, the first one is Sarah Foster. And she's one that I contacted just on a whim. Blanket email, you know, it was probably like, you know, sales at Foster's Market or Sarah at Foster's Market or something. Um, and she, we developed a friendship over this common bond of, of, you know, loving gourmet foods and specialty foods. And I don't talk to her a lot, but when I do contact her, you know, it's always relevant. I don't just, you know, you know, cause I, she's extremely busy, you know, she's always on the go doing something. Um, I make sure that I use my time with her valuably. You know, I, I, I if it's a, a question that I know that she can really help me with, I think she knows that I'm not, you know, I'm not wasting her time. Like I'm not, you know, emailing her for a free signed copy of her cookbook, right. you know? And I think that, you know, it, in turn, um, I was able to actually help her believe it or not, um, because she's thinking of marketing her products more and she wanted to know, you know, who was I using uh -huh. for any distribution? So it's, it's sort of, as I start to do more in my career, I mean, I'm nowhere near, you know, where she is obviously, but we're, we're kind of intersecting in certain areas, so we're actually able to make it sort of a mutual relationship where I'm able to, you know, give back to her a little bit. Um, and it's become a lot more of like a friendship too, which is great. So don't be intimidated to contact people. I mean, the worst that they can do is not get back to you or say no. Mm -hmm. But usually if someone has gotten to the point where they're successful, they didn't get there by being, you know, an unresponsive person. So I think that that's really important.